While it's a sunny day in downtown Washington, D.C., the tranquility is suddenly disrupted by an unfortunate event that suddenly happens to two older men. Hey, watch out, watch out behind you! Two women who don't look like criminals have decided to commit a crime against two older men. Unexpectedly, the victims can restrain one, but the other tries to fight back. Amid the chaos, one of the perpetrators freed himself from the victim's grip. They left the victim and successfully continued their crime spree, leaving the victim injured and in shock. On June 26, 2021, the inevitable incident occurred at Club Paradise, creating tension and generating reports from panicked residents about what was happening in the area. The CCTV footage shows a bustling atmosphere outside the club with people from different groups gathering. Still, in the middle of the day, they became involved in a feud and escalated the situation. One of the perpetrators who started the shooting escaped into a house where he continued to attack the other group outside through the door. Following this incident, Temple Police searched for the perpetrators, who were still at large. On a quiet night in Atlanta, an incident involving a teenager leads us to severe challenges and consequences. What's wrong with you, man? What are you shoving me like that for, man? That night, reports came in from a convenience store on Atlanta Avenue. Officers responded to reports of an altercation involving a gun. They found Taven Shelton, a 17-year-old juvenile, about to leave the convenience store. Don't move. I got a gun on the bed. 6'9 recovered. Don't move. <clears throat> the officers should have taken action against Shelton. After a search, an unexpected object was found. The police officers took him away for further investigation. In East Oakland, video surveillance captured an incident at a store in the middle of the night. A tense atmosphere was in the air as a group of people wearing black hoodies and some wearing face masks entered the store. They initially asked the store owner for tobacco, but when asked for their identities, they refused to give it. Sensing that something was about to happen, the shopkeeper was cautious and didn't act rashly until the predictable incident occurred. One of them pulled out a gun and pointed it at the shopkeeper. They took money from the drawer and some items from the shop before running away. On a night in Atlanta, a disturbance on a roadside turns into a tragedy. In this footage, a group of people are arguing with each other, increasing tension. They are seen carrying items that can be used to commit violence against each other, creating a tense atmosphere that night. The unrest came to a tragic end in May when Dominic McKibbins, an 18-year-old teenager, was shot and killed on Donald Lee Hollowell Parkway. Atlanta police are now trying to identify those involved in the incident. It was a quiet shopping day at Oakbrook Center Mall. However, an unexpected incident turned the atmosphere into chaos. In the surveillance video, several people ran into the Louis Vuitton store, making shoppers panic. They quickly grabbed items without paying attention to the shopkeeper. These people continued their actions. The shopkeeper tried to stop them, but some thieves resisted and tried to escape. Despite the efforts of the shopkeeper to stop the thieves, some items were stolen. A shocking event quickly unfolded at an Apple store in California, causing confusion and panic among visitors to the busy Apple store.
While the store was busy, a group of men quickly ran into the store. They acted quickly and organized, regardless of the people who were there. The moment was captured when the group of men continued the action, while the shopkeeper could only see and could not prevent their action. And after the action was successful, they ran away without regret. On a night in Detroit, we explore the slums full of nightlife. The atmosphere is tense, but also engaging to explore. Along the streets, we see many young people huddled together, busy with their activities, creating a unique and different image from other areas of Detroit. Driving through the dark and seedy streets, we see young men gathered together, perhaps looking for fun or to relax. However, there is an eerie atmosphere that emanates from the darkness and squalor of this area. In a Memphis gas station store, what should be a quiet night turns into chaos. An argument between two men takes center stage, bringing tension to the forefront. Two men are involved in an altercation, seen arguing with each other in a rising tone of voice. One of the men shouts angrily, trying to explain their problems. Unexpectedly, the angry man takes unexpected action against the other man, who is shirtless. Physical violence ensues, and people who see the scene are forced to intervene to separate and calm the two men so that the situation does not escalate further. On a sunny day at the Lakeside Mall in Benoni, the once tranquil everyday life was instantly turned into a scene from an action movie. CCTV footage shows shoppers running from the mall's exits, looking for shelter, and a tense atmosphere is instantly created around the mall. Something dangerous is about to happen. As the chaos continues, no one dares to get in the way of the confrontation. Bullets were scattered throughout the mall, threatening everyone who was there. The situation began to calm down as the armed group got their loot. A warning for Chicago's west side, where a wave of armed robberies overshadowed Tuesday morning. The Chicago Police Department issued a warning to the local community after 10 tragic incidents occurred in just two hours. Colored sedan pulled up just before 7:30 Saturday night, and four armed men with hoods up, wearing masks, jump out, taking his wallet at gunpoint. That had two surveillance footage captured the tense moment when two men were attacked by a group of armed men outside an auto repair shop. The robbers mercilessly pointed guns at the men. Cash a customer had just paid him inside. No, nunca pensé que me fuera a tocar a mí. He says he never thought it would happen to him. This man is just one of more than a dozen people robbed. Inside the garage, the robbers threatened the men and demanded their property. They quickly took valuables and money before fleeing the scene. On the sunny afternoon of June 28, 2022, a normally quiet gas station witnessed horrific action between two groups of men who suddenly found themselves in a tense encounter. A man gets out of a white sedan with a gun in his hand and walks toward the entrance of the store. However, his steps are stopped as something terrible is about to happen to him. And then it gets even scarier. The man, without hesitation, returns fire at the perpetrator in the black sedan. The shooting was inevitable, making customers inside the store run outside to save themselves. A tragedy has shaken the lives of a Stanislaus County family. They are demanding justice after losing loved ones in a deadly home invasion in Ceres last September. I'm opening it. I'm opening it. I'm opening it. I'm opening it. What's your name? I'm What's your name? I'm opening it. What's your name? What's your name? The home invasion occurred in the early morning hours in the 2600 block of Gondring Road. Surveillance footage shows the group pointing a gun at the victim, Christian Sanchez.
After Sanchez opens the door, several of the burglars enter the house. While one tries to tamper with the surveillance camera, the scene is agitated and the presence of a life-threatening weapon adds to the tension. A bank employee was doing his job on a sunny winter's day. Unsuspecting, he carries valuables inside the bank into an armored vehicle parked outside. However, when the bank employee opened the vehicle's back door, a tense scene ensued. A group of robbers who had been lurking in a nearby black car got out and pointed a gun at the bank employee. The employee was helpless and the robbers freely looted the contents of the armored vehicle. After robbing the contents of the vehicle, the robbers fled in their car, leaving chaos and fear at the scene. An unexpected event shakes up the afternoon atmosphere in a jewelry store. As the incident unfolded, the atmosphere became tense and full of fear. Staff and customers were unable to do much when the robbery took place. The beautifully displayed jewelry in the window became an easy target for the robbers, who were quick to act. However, shockingly, a man suspected to be the store owner showed incredible courage. Without hesitation, he picked up a gun and fired a single bullet into the leg of one of the robbers, forcing them to flee quickly. A shocking event occurs at the Topanga Mall, in a city that never sleeps. A shocking scene, as a mysterious group of people invade the mall. Police officers investigate earnestly, trying to uncover the common thread behind this series of events. This question comes after a series of flash mob robberies in LA County. This is the second such incident this week alone. But are these incidents related or are they just coincidences? Behind the city's bright lights, the night is only sometimes friendly. At a North Memphis gas station, the quiet of the night is disturbed by an unexpected act. Under the dim lights, a man is refueling his car. Unexpectedly, bad luck stalks him. A footstep approaches slowly. A mysterious figure emerges from the shadows carrying evil intentions. The eyewitness who saw the incident could remain silent, not daring to fight back for his safety. The silence of the night bears witness to a robbery. Fear enveloped the victim at gunpoint. Threat after threat was made, forcing the victim to hand over his valuables. Behind the bright lights of the city, the night is not always friendly. A store in North Houston witnesses a gripping incident that shatters the tranquility of the night. This video from a store in North Houston shows a clerk as he faces four robbers with guns aimed right at his... Under the dim lights, a shopkeeper is unaware of lurking danger. Four men enter the store pretending to be shoppers, but moments later, they carry evil intentions cigarettes. The clerk was not hurt, thankfully. But if you know who these men are, call Crime Stoppers at 713-222-TIPS. The shopkeeper realizes something terrible will happen and is helpless against the menacing robbers. Fear and panic envelop the situation. Investigations are now underway to identify the perpetrators. Police officers are working hard to gather evidence and hunt down these criminals. Behind the tranquil town of Shelbyville, a reckless act shook the quiet night. Two men have planned an epic crime spree at an automated teller machine. They work carefully together, carrying the tools that will be used to carry out this action. They are seen following their plan meticulously, making sure each step is done perfectly. Using a car and a chain, the two men begin their action without hesitation and it takes little time for the moment of their planned action to be accomplished. Although they managed to get away with some money, the police are investigating to identify and arrest the perpetrators. 
A very daring incident was captured on the security camera footage of a gun store in Houston, Texas. The footage shows that a group had carefully planned this stunt in the middle of the night. They have carefully parked the truck to facilitate their actions. Several members of the group work together for this epic moment. With the store looking deserted and without a single guard, the robbers were free to carry out their actions. The CCTV was the only silent witness to this incident while no one else was around. A potentially dangerous prank occurred on the night of March 4th, 2023 at a Memphis gas station. A man was cleaning the road at the gas station not knowing that someone in a car was planning a dangerous prank. And look what happened next. In the surveillance footage, a car exits the gas station and suddenly stops. The car's driver lights up something that appears to be dangerous to the people cleaning the area. Moments later, a severe prank by the driver occurs. Quickly, the person leaves the scene after performing the act. On a quiet Monday afternoon in Pleasant Hill, California, estates consignments witnessed an exciting event. Here you see the woman walking out and stalling, trying to keep the security guard from shutting the door to let her friends in. But they force the door open and bum rush their way inside. A watch and jewelry store becomes the setting for suspense as a female shopper leaves the store, unaware of the threat lurking outside. The store owner becomes suspicious of her activities and senses that something terrible is about to happen. After a worker screams, Marcou makes his way to the jewelry section, as do the intruders. Marcou then pulls out his gun. The group scatters out of the shop. However, in this tense incident, the shopkeeper showed courage and quick thinking. Without hesitation, he took drastic measures to protect his business. A security video shows a tense moment at an upscale clothing store in Queens. Over the weekend, this shocking incident rocked the Ridgewood neighborhood and highlighted New York's growing security concerns. Security video shows the robbers. The footage shows a group of people quickly entering the store. This scene creates an atmosphere of tension that feels real. For the next couple minutes, the robbers fill garbage bags with high end jeans, sweatshirts, jackets, and more. They leave one rack almost completely empty. Police efforts to investigate similar cases have not made it clear whether the perpetrators were involved in other crimes around Queens and Brooklyn. The store shelves are almost empty within minutes, with many pairs of high-end jeans and jackets stolen. Two patrol officers from the Ohio Police Department were driving quietly, carrying out their routine duties to keep the city safe. Suddenly, their eyes fell on a car traveling at high speed, raising suspicions. El Salvador, El Salvador. Okay, gotcha. All right. I'm not going to issue a citation or anything like that. All right, I'm just going to run your information. The officers chase the suspicious car, and eventually, the suspicious vehicle stops with several passengers inside. A routine check of the suspected driver and passengers was conducted. I'm just going to put you back here for just a second. Okay? Upon further investigation, police found sufficient evidence to arrest Velasquez Larin and an associate who was also a suspect. Both were then taken into custody. On May 8, 2022, the silence of the night at Hotel Native Denver was broken by a commotion. A heated argument erupted between several men, triggering an unexpected chain of events at 3 a.m. The scene initially looks normal, with a few men walking down the hotel hallway, but what happens next is unpredictable and shocking to everyone inside. Surveillance footage captured the tense moment. At first, the atmosphere seems normal. However, the tensions slowly escalated as the arguments became more heated. The atmosphere is full of anger and frustration. Suddenly, the situation explodes. An unexpected incident occurred at the Balenciaga store, creating a dire situation. 
it took the group from Newark just 24 seconds to steal 48 handbags from the Balenciaga store in East Hampton Village two weeks ago. When she went into the store, she... when the store was quiet, without expecting anything wrong to happen, four individuals entered the store as they appeared to be moving quickly and in an organized manner. The police responded quickly after the incident was reported. In Philadelphia, on September 26, 2023, a tense atmosphere is created in the vicinity of 607 Walnut Street as an Apple store becomes the scene of a horrific incident captured on videotape. In the footage, the group is seen forcing their way into the store. They quickly carried out their well-planned action, creating a tense situation inside the store. Philadelphia police are asking for help from the public to identify the looters. They are currently wanted by police, who are hunting down the suspects for investigation and arrest. As night fell, an unexpected event shattered the peace of a man who owned a car at an automated teller machine. Unexpectedly, that night became the beginning of the worst story he had ever experienced in his life. The general says a gang member is now convicted of a carjacking back in 2016. The DA says 23-year-old Edward Springs carjacked a man at a... The security footage shows two men who have carefully planned their actions. Seeing an opportunity in a car driven by an older man, they quickly did the act without thinking. His truck. They say the two took the truck to other cities where they carjacked another victim. Spring is said to be sentenced on September 26th. He faces 15 to 20 In a state of panic, the man is left in fear. Not long after, the perpetrators returned to rob him again. The police quickly identified them and arrested them as fugitives from justice. On a quiet night, a shocking incident occurred inside a car dealership in Kentucky. While most people were asleep, three unknown men acted quickly and skillfully in the middle of the quiet night. In security footage depicting a crime scene that unfolds in seconds, they move with speed and coordination, leaving the scene without a trace. One morning in Denver, an unexpected event occurred at a gas station store. Three individuals entered the store with a clear purpose. Surveillance video shows the tension as the perpetrators spring into action. They quickly take what they want and threaten the clerks on duty. The three robbers quickly fled, leaving chaos in their wake. The police are now hunting for the perpetrators to bring them to justice.